Hello everyone, Angela O'Hare here, your favorite Las Vegas realtor. Wow, guess where I'm at? I'm over here in Cordillera at the Red Point Square Village by Toll Brothers. Um, this community has been around for a while, but the model homes just recently opened up and I'm super excited to check out these model homes. These are considered townhomes here. And uh, so yeah, we're gonna check out the three different uh, floor plans that they have. This one is the Casella. And you have option of three to four bedrooms with two and a half baths, two car garage, and it's the smallest floor plan at 1803 square feet. So they have different uh, configurations. You can have four um, townhomes together or three townhomes together. And some of them, depending if it has it, has a rooftop deck. So when you walk in here, this is what's called the flex space. Um, you have an option of converting this into a bedroom or keeping it as open as an office. So it's a great feature. You know, a lot of these builders like Woodside Homes over there in Obsidian, they were doing a lot of these type of floor plans where it's three level living and you know, the main level living is probably on the second floor. We'll see how it is over here. Also Pulte over there at uh, Blacktail has done something similar, but those are single family homes. Whereas this is a town home where other homes are attached to it. So I like the, the, this looks like engineered hardwood floors that they had selected, the beautiful windows. So yes, here is the living on the second floor. Very beautiful. Now in these model homes, they spend a lot of money on the upgrades. Basically, pretty much everything you see in here is an upgrade and it would cost a lot differently if you were to buy from ground up. So the HOA in this community is a total of $203, $55 for Summerlin West, $148 for Cordillera. They also have a community pool, but it is not gated. So right here you have a half bath off of the kitchen. You have your dining room across from the kitchen. Beautiful upgraded cabinets with the white, I love the stacked horizontal tiles, super nice and then the appliances. Then you also have the um, pantry. Oh, I guess you have two pantries in here, which you have this pantry as well, which is very nice and an added feature. Then the island with the quartz countertops and the waterfall, the farmer sink, and then the double ovens. Now, usually when you buy from scratch, you're gonna go to the design studio and pick out all of your upgrades. You're also gonna pick out what's called an electrical package. You also will pick out your appliance package. So all of these start adding up. I would imagine this community has what's called quick move-in homes because they've been building for a long time here, and Toll Brothers does take quite some time to build, that the homes, they may have some with the options already selected where you don't have to choose anything in here. So this is, I think this is a good space. Um, and then you also have a covered patio off of the family or open guest area. It's cute. Yeah, these models took forever to build. I remember when they first opened this community, it was either in 2022 or 2021, and I couldn't wait for um, the models to open. Toll Brothers is really well known for opening um, the community before the models are ready. So where's the stairs at? Did I miss something? Oh, that's kind of cool, that's hidden. I like that, I like that. And then we're gonna go up to the third level. Third level would have all your bedrooms. I really like these windows. Okay. So, I bet you this is the primary bedroom. Love all the detailed work the barn doors, the double vanity with the lights underneath, the shower, and then you also have the toilet right there. Oh, 
I knew it. Stackable laundry. I'm sure this is going to be an upgrade to have the cabinets. You know what? I forgot to mention the most important thing is the base price. The base price, depending on elevation, is starting at 568995 And if you want the house that has the rooftop deck, I do believe that price goes up. So here's one of the bedrooms. They're decent size. As you can see, you can fit a queen size bed with two dressers. And looks like they're doing the whole barn door thing, which I would imagine it comes with traditional sliders instead of the barn door. Um, yeah, that's a small closet. And then you have another bedroom. Looks a little smaller. See, this is the traditional doors. This is probably just for the entertainment unit. And then you have the secondary bathroom, which is a little small with only one sink. At least you do have some room on the sink to put whatever you need to put. And then it has the tub and shower combination. Now we're going to go up to the rooftop. Each of these that are modeled has a rooftop deck. Now when you buy, some um, houses do not have the rooftop. Like that. Ooh, nice. Would you consider this on the roof? Not necessarily. I don't think this is really on the roof because the roof is right there, but I like the pergola that they built on it. Now, depending on where you are in this community, you may be able to have houses that have views of the city. If you can see right here, it's low windy. They have views of the strip. And, but the only downfall is you're gonna have be very close to your neighbor um, so there's not much privacy on this side. The person that has the N1 may have more privacy than the person that has it next to these two. So it's kind of interesting how that works out. Whoa. A little dangerous. So let's take a look back in the second floor. Great room. And we look at that. It's a lot of stairs. So if you are much older, this is not for you because it's a lot of stairs and there's no elevators in this community. So to summarize, we're over here at Cordillera. We are looking at the Casella floor plan, and this is 1803 square feet with three or four bedrooms and two and a half baths um, and a two car garage, and it's the smallest floor plan in this community. Base price is starting out at 568,995. I'm gonna go check out the other floor plans. Let me know in the comments what you think of this floor plan in this community, and make sure you know what to do, right? Like and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys on the next one.